Hello, family and friends. Welcome into your spiritual nourishment. I am your shaman empress, aka the shaman hummingbird. Let's go ahead and get you some oracle love message. What are your oracle love messages? Let's see. What are your oracle love messages for the collective? Oh, no worries allowed. Someone here feels like you're not going to accept them back. This is someone here. Yep, this is what they've been crying about. This person could be secretly crying about this. This also could be you. Yeah, soul tie. You have a soul tie with this person. Yeah. Child, now the ancestors is involved. So you're going to get an ancestor message and see what that's about gut feeling. So there's something that you're not accepting from this person. But there's still a soul tie that you have with this person. This person connects with you under the full moon a lot. They could project their energy towards you. You see how in all three of those cards, there's a moon. All right. If you feel like, is it this person that you're feeling? It is. Okay. Yeah. And the ancestors have been here. Yeah. This person could have been up to no good. We got forbidden fruit. So the ancestor doesn't care for your person too much here. I knew it. There could have been some spell work done. I was seeing that moon energy. Now, for some of you guys, this is literal magic. For others, you guys, there could have this is someone that could be into darker things. This person could be manipulated. This is manipulate. This is emotional manipulation as well. Someone here wears ombre um, lipstick. Someone here has a picture of their ancestor on the wall. This will be a woman. And this woman does not like this man. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Or this damn woman. It. Take it how it resonates damn with it you. Moment. Now, someone here also could have tried to manipulate you by buying you something, a gift, but you didn't take it. You didn't accept it. Mind game. So, this was mental spells. So, your ancestors saw this person plan mental spell or doing some kind of mental spell work on you. Is what this is. And someone, the ancestors don't, you know, they don't like shit like that, child. Ego death. This is, okay, so your ancestor could be taking your person through an ego death. Some of you guys could definitely be, have like, um, your, you could be wearing your afro styles, your kinks, your tight curls. Alright, you see in each three of these pictures, you can see these curls. All right, so you guys could be wearing little afros, big afros, medium afros, natural styles, just natural. Natural beauty is really, it looks good on you, honey. Damn it. Now, I do see some of you guys um have gotten a little bit darker, okay, under that sun, honey. Now, for others of you guys, you might need to get you some sunblock, all right, if you don't have a lot of melanin in your skin, okay, because there is going to be some kind of sunburn here. Okay, with that sun being there. You see how her skin is? Some of you guys could be dealing with pillin issues, facial issues. Hmm. All right. So this is someone that likes to play mind games. So your ancestors heard things that you didn't hear in the story when it came to this person. So that that's why the ancestors ended this story for a lot of you guys. Things you didn't know, things that was said, even things that this person has thought. But this is someone that you do have a current um, current soul tie to. That's why you're this this is energy is blocked. Your ancestors is blocking this energy. Let's get let's let let the ancestors speak, child. We're gonna get a message. All right, from the end. Oh, honor the light. This person didn't honor you. Stand in the light. This is someone that was playing mind games. This person didn't claim you. This is also someone that wouldn't claim you. Whether you knew that or not, your ancestors knew that. Some of you guys could have ancestor statues. This can even be a picture that looks like an ancestor statue. Take it how it resonates. 
on the wall or something like that. You can also own a unk of some way, shape, or form. You can even have a unk on your altar. Some I mean, of you guys got crystals and moon balls on your altar. You can even um, have a mirror. Whatever spell work was done, this were reflected right back onto this person. If you just gave like your ancestors any kind of treat that has any kind of berry in it, they like that. Um, I'm also seeing lemons and coffee. All right, so some of you guys be feeding your ancestors coffee. This could be a lemon pound cake. Mm. I'm tasting a lemon pound cake. Some of you guys could have a broken mirror on your whoever whoever is doing spell work or if this was just literally doing spell work because there's a little bit of that here to get into your mind you didn't know this person was in the spell work and whatever if this was mirror magic the mirror broke when this um spell backfired As soon as I said that power of the awakening, yep. This also could have um, caused you to wake up about this person. Power of the good, yeah. Man, that puma been coming out like every time I since I picked up these cards. Intelligence and strength and courage is here. The beautiful place, yeah. For some of you guys, you got to download. Yep, I tell you. The moon, Madula of the moon. This could have been spell work that was done in the moon, but it transformed you. The ancestors came through. This is why you were protected, honey. She within the emerald heart. Anytime that your heart chakra, for some of you guys, you're a pure heart. Your frequency and your energy level is too high for this kind of spell work to work. For this mental spell to work. Whether this is literal someone having candles or not. Someone here um, don't have candles on their altar. Now some of you guys could have a cord on your altar. The ancestors could be like encouraging you to do a cord cutting ritual. Okay, you could be getting downloads about that over the moon energies. We're going to have to see which moon comes up here. So let's see what kind of uh, mind games this person was playing. Let's get the golden girls on this. Show me more about this. Uh, let's start with the spell work. Let's start with the spell work. I see Eight of Swords in reverse. Yeah, this was mental. <laughs> this, this, yeah, this person, you could be having dreams of this person and things of that nature as well. Child, I can't make it up. They did spell work around this moon energy. This is also when the veil was thin and this kind of energy was uh, thrown at you. Page of Wands. Here, yeah, yep, but it was blocked. It didn't work. This could have, this was a masculine energy or alpha female. This is someone, was that in Capricorn? It was in Capricorn. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Love you so much. But you were guarded, you were blocked from this. Mm -hmm. This is also someone that was hot in secrets. The secret was to play a man game with you, to have sex with you, and then to ghost you. This person, yeah, they were going to give you little to nothing. This is also someone that was going to put you on block. Show me something more about the moon. What else we need to know more about the moon? Mm. The three of wands, yep, they were going to get distant. Yeah, three of swords, this was going to break your heart. Yeah. The magician, yep, that's what they were manifesting. That's what, This is what this person wanted to do. Mm -hmm. Show me something about the soul tie. What's going on about the soul? Oh. This is your divine masculine. Whether this is an alpha female or a 
man. This person wanted to take a chance to get you in the soul tap. This is also someone here that feels foolish. Yep. And they're trying to get their strength up. Yep. This caused a lot of chaos and drama by doing this, by trying this. Mm-hmm. This is a dramatic soul tie. This soul tie is a lot of drama. More, um, I was asking more about this um, spell work here. Uh, the three of wands and the seven of cups. Yep. This is this is what it was about. Getting you in your feelings. And then getting distance on you. And then going five of pentacles. Yep. That's This person wanted sex. Yep. Seven of pentacles. That's, that was the decision. That's what they were investing in. That is the truth. This could have been for money for some of you guys. Um, yeah. <laughs> and the ancestors uh, knew things that you didn't. Heard things that you didn't. Um... Okay. Let's see. Yeah, let's see this person's feelings and emotions towards you right now. We're going to use these cards. Unicorn. They feel like this is, they troll you. Oh my gosh, that's what I heard. That's what I read. I almost screamed, y'all. Y'all done. Y'all be tired to be screaming. They, they troll you. This person is trolling you, child. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn but they trolling you, child. It's because their game didn't work, though. Child, you looking like a snack. And for some of you guys, they know that you're spiritual. Believe it or not, they like the spirituality side about you. Yep, privilege. Especially, yeah, they know that you are a white witch. You know we talk life and breathe life on my channel. Okay. Um, this is also someone here. Yeah, they could know that you, um, they know that you have went through a transformation. Yeah, they do. This, ooh. Child, they know they didn't call you a bitch a couple times, okay, with legend being there. These two is turned over. They are jealous. This is someone here that wants you to kind of stay in your own lane. Um, this is someone here that could be also mad that this spell don't work didn't this spell work didn't work on whatever level. So they feel like you got out on them. It yeah. They do. Shadow is also here. See, one of you guys are like love and light. You send off love and light. Some of you guys could be into your own oils and stuff like that. Is also what I'm getting. You have cried a lot. Also, when you did your enough of your shadow side, this person knows that you cry a lot. Just so you know that. They're aware of that. That you have definitely went through transformations. That has could have led you into your calling, your spiritual growth as well. This person is not ready to do their spiritual work. No. In fact, it's crazy because they see it. They might like this new sap about you but because they feel like in some way shape or form this energy got out on them they still kind of want to come back as an energy vampire mm, let's see what this now if you want to hear from someone from your past let's see It's funny because this person, jealousy is here. This could be also someone here that sends you the evil eye. 
because of what happened because they're mad but no one compares to you see and i got to be honest it could be because they didn't and no one they this could have worked with everybody else but you this kind of game this mind game they play and this is someone from your past father wounds and loss this one, this person could have lost their father when they were young. They could have also their dad could have even passed away. This is someone here that could have grew up without a dad. Didn't I tell you they ass is crying? Double. This person cried at least twice about you. At least twice about you, honey. They are missing you. And now this is someone that has something to say. There's something I really want to share with you. I'm waiting for a right time to tell you. So for some of you guys, this could be someone here that's waiting for the right time to tell you something. If you want to hear from someone from your future, let's get a message. Okay, well, from your future. Spooling you in reverse. Yep, this person plays a lot. Of, just know this is what you're going to be going through with this person. This person is stingy. Mm -hmm. Spoiling you sideways. Yep. This is someone that's not going to, they're going to, I said that, I believe, earlier. They're going to give the fucking bare minimum. Yeah. Whatever Those they can get to get moment. what they want. It says a mind game. I'm leaving. Let me go. Yep. It's a mind game. You are so smart. Now, for some of you guys, you're going to figure this out, especially about this a new person. You just let me go. You deserve all the good things in this world. And right now, I am not in a space to give you that type of connection. You deserve life. And you deserve to live your life and let me go. Is what this person is saying. One more time. You deserve all the good things in this world. And right now, I am not in a space to give you the type of connection you deserve. Live your life and let me go. But this person, and this is, this is the thing. They should have just said that. This is someone here that will tell you this after they slept with you, after they got what they want, after this mind game work. This is also someone that got the gift of gab, good with their words, honey. So just be careful. Next thing you know, they rapping like Drake. Next thing you know, this thing like Chris Brown and your pants is there. Whether you are a man or a woman. Okay. Let's get this Oracle message. The thing is, this is someone here that's used to dealing with power. But they should have known that Archangel Michael holds the power. Okay. I got the power. Power. Yeah, honey. Oh, that's what I'm hearing. <laughs> yeah. See, that's the thing. Mm -hmm. This is someone here. The thing was to get you to surrender. That was the plan. All right. Let's get these shapes in order. Order, I say. You could be talking to someone in the military. Someone here, um, you could have just studied the Titanic, watched what the late, you know, there's a, some, there was a little bit of situation around the Titanic that just yeah, happened. Yeah, you could have watched that in some shape, um, some way, shape or form. You also could be a Titanic fan, watch the movie or just watch the Titanic. Look inside yourself. Yeah. This could have caused a transformation for you to child damn look damn inside damn yourself. Damn this was your twin flame. Now, for some of you guys, you know this come out in almost every reading, almost in every deck. You know what kind of channel this is that you're having this romance to. That could have turned into a soul tie. The past is now behind you. Release it and embrace new possibilities. A new path is now available to you. Follow with faith. Now, for some of you guys, um, for right now. You and your twin flame is energetically blocked. Friendship. Right now, it could be because you guys need to learn how to treat each other. Um, twin flames are always connected. More of how to... Um, there's different things you need at different times of your relationship. This is a time where it's more about friendship with your person. Your other half. Um, if in being friend to yourself, or how could you be a friend to others, even your twin flame? Okay. All right. Through the cries, through the tears, through the hurt, through the pain. And for some of you guys, 
1949 on a timer. This had to happen for the transformation here to take place to possibly build a friendship. And who said this shit was going to be easy? God didn't say the weapons weren't formed, honey. He said they wouldn't prosper. That was a damn it moment. Okay, and that was a damn it moment. All right, let's go ahead and get these oracle messages. Let's see. Get more information, guys. information is here let's see oh okay this is someone here that's going to possibly look for a sign i said when it child they said when it feels safe and look what's on the bottom of the deck peaceful resolution so they're looking for things to be up because now it's not the right time improving health they want to heal some they should they know they might need to heal, heal some now for some of you guys this is someone that's ducking you because their mind games has been exposed here and the ancestors exposed this now they screaming not the right time let's go ahead and get these signs of planets honey i can't make it up this all could have went down um under the last moon in capricorn and we all know that is ruled by saturn and capricorn Okay. Yeah, see, that's the thing. Uh, this twin flame don't want to be a op, but they want to act. It seems like they might want to act like a op. Okay. All right. Then, and I tell you, your intellect really turns me on. You are so smart, and I really enjoy our conversations. Puma energy, intellect, strength. That's the sounds of planet. Gosh, so we got the 12th house. That's the Piscean energy someone here is in their feelings. There is gossip. There's talk. This is also someone that could be gossiping and talking about this change. Uranus energy that is in, you know, we are in the era of Aquarian. Things are changing. How much things are changing just in the energy, just in the atmosphere as well. 5052 is your angel number. 5052 is your angel number 2212 on a timer. All right. This comes to you to inspire you that there is power in believing in yourself. Never stop dreaming just because you failed in something. This person that is not given. Okay. So what I'm getting is, and what they're what they're saying is, this is someone here, to be quite honest with you. They're going to have to get their shit together. And that's what the ancestors, that's what the spirit team is getting them to do. Um, before they come towards you. That's why it's coming up. Not the right time. Yep, get more information. You're ready. Yep, and this is someone that's going to try to compromise with you. Now, right now is not the right time. So, so for some of you guys, this is unfortunately, it's just, it's, it's not the right time right now. They're not coming towards you. I'm not going to lie. You know, we know we family. I'm going to talk to you. Tension and invitation. This is also someone here. They know that this is, this is going to be a strong, intense conversation. It might even be a little argument involved. But the whole point is to nurture on each other. Friendship. You guys going to have to work on your friendship. You guys have to work on how to be friends to one another. I think this is what this is where you are in this. Okay, I'm spying on you the karmic. Now you got these karmic spying on you. Yo, he or she knows I love you. So there's a karmic that's your twin flames that is spying on you, children. Child, what in the hell on YouTube? You could be a YouTuber, all right? Out of the country, car, uh, four door car recorded. Yeah, you could be uploading, um, you guys, I mean, this um, is YouTube, so it could be that too. Some of you guys here could be a four, have a four-door car. I want to stop you. I try to work it out because of the kids, DL, same sex. Someone here could be high in their sexual appetite. Um, they don't, uh, they're not going to let you leave. I am getting that as, as well. Mental health. This person plays my games. This uh, this also could be blood magic done here. Someone here, dark hair, stiletto nails. All right. Sexual frustration. Get yeah, was blood magic down. Root shock. Or someone here could have got pregnant on purpose. Because they knew this person would stay and work it out because of the kids. Now, this person got pregnant around their moon cycle doing blood magic. And that's why this keep coming out. That is sex magic. Just so you know that. Damn it. Um, look at this shit right here. I want to get you pregnant on purpose. Mm, mm, mm. 
I told third eye. Yeah. But the ancestors saw everything. All right, guys. I hope this helps you out in more ways than one. It answers a lot of questions that you can seek today. Um, these are general, so please only take what is for you and leave what is not. All right, guys. Connect your frequency and your energy. Like and subscribe and sharing. Connecting. Uplifting. Each other is all donations, all right? Make sure you are stopping pissed so you're updated on all of your spiritual messages and conversations. Stay dope. Next video upload, baby. I'll share name one.